Hey everyone, Shannon here, and today I will be teaching you how to create a swinging title motion graphic in After Effects. Let's get started. Okay, so we're in After Effects and we're going to go ahead and set up a new composition. New. And we're going to call this swinging title. And we will set our duration. And a black background is fine because we're going to create a ramp background with this. Make sure we have our title, title action safe on here. And we're going to go to layer, new, solid, and we want this solid to be black. Now go over to your effects pane and we're going to type in ramp. And we're just going to drag it onto the composition. A ramp adds a little gradient effect to your motion graphic instead of just one solid background. And I'm going to change this to the colors that I want to, and you could play around with this as well just to get the background that you want set up. So I like a nice blue and black for my title. And we're going to go to the text tool. And we're just going to type swing. And we're going to add a new text layer for title. So all of your words need to be on a separate text layer to achieve this effect. And we're going to go ahead and center it. Alright, now we're going to highlight both of those. Right click to create a new pre-comp. We're just going to call that title. And we're going to go into the title comp to edit our title to swing. We need to grab our pan behind anchor tool to change the anchor point and we're going to set our anchor point to the top of the text in order for the text to swing down and we'll do the same for the title text all right now we need our text layers to be 3d layers in order to uh, have them swing. So we're going to set our first keyframe of our X rotation to about 96 so that we can't see our title at the top yet. It kind of disappears, it kind of lays flat. And then we'll go to our next keyframe and set the keyframe to, to bring that title down a little bit so it swings right down from you not seeing it at all to it coming into view. So when you're setting your keyframes, make sure it doesn't swing all the way back up the top. You know how usually when, you, when a sign is swinging in the wind or if you hit a sign on a chain, it usually doesn't swing back right up to the top. It usually, you know, comes to a slow uh, stopping motion. So we're going to go ahead and keep setting our keyframes to that swinging motion. And again, you want it to gradually stop swinging. So you don't want these massive swinging motions. You kind of want it to look natural. and we just bring it all the way down, back and forth until we hit zero. All right, so we've hit zero, and we're gonna go back to the beginning and see how that plays out. Getting the physics of it right and it to look natural is just, you know, playing with the keyframes. So I wanna add an easy ease to this, so I'm gonna highlight all the keyframes and right click on one keyframe and go to keyframe assistant and easy ease. So it kind of gradually stops. And then we're gonna go down to our title and just copy those keyframes, those same exact keyframes, just to save time. Now you don't have to, this is just for the tutorial's sake. And we're gonna offset those keyframes because I want the swinging title to come down first, then the title text. So we have the swinging coming down first, and then the title. 
and we're going to set that first keyframe of the title text to 92.5. So again, we can't see it, it's flat. Until we go back to our main comp, and it comes down. So you see the swinging text and the title text are kind of offset. Creates this cool little effect. Next, we're just going to add a drop shadow. Now, I use, like using drop shadows. You don't have to. Uh, this is just personal preference, so I'm going to play around with my drop shadow a bit. And we're going to add a camera just to create some, some depth with this, with this title, just so it's not static on a background. We're going to add a camera. Now, your title needs to be a 3D layer in order for the camera to work, and we're going to play with the zoom of the camera. We're going to set some keyframes on the zoom of the camera. So right now I am in the top view of the camera in two views. Now to change the camera view you can go right to your bar where your title action safe and resolution options are. And I'm just going to play around with the zoom so the title gradually zooms in while it's swinging. Just to make it interesting. You know it's just about setting keyframes just to make it look natural. And again, this is personal preference. This doesn't work for everything. All right, and we come back to our comp. And that looks really good. Now you have your swinging title motion graphic. Thank you for watching my tutorial. Please feel free to visit the links below to check out more of my work or to get in contact with me. And stay tuned for more.